you ever wondered why the full moon seems larger when it's near the horizon than it's high overhead? If so, you're not alone. You may think perhaps the moon is just closer to the earth on that particular day than usual. But if you actually measure the visible size of the moon, you will realize that it hasn't changed at all. What if I told you that the moon is always the same size? In fact, when it seems to change size, the moon is playing tricks on your brain. This phenomenon is called the moon illusion. While the exact explanation for this optical illusion is still debated, there are two main theories for its occurrence. The first one is the Ebenhaus illusion theory. When the moon is near to the horizon, there are many different objects such as trees and buildings that people can use to compare to the size of the moon. But when the moon is high in the sky, there is nothing surrounding it to compare to it, and it therefore in comparison seem much smaller against the vastness of the night sky. Thus, two identical objects can look different due to the reference objects surrounding them. Another possibility is the Ponzo illusion theory. If you have ever tried to draw in perspective, you will know that as objects get closer to the horizon, the smaller you should draw them. Thus, our brains make us perceive objects near to the horizon as larger than they actually appear. With these explanations, it seems like we've solved the mystery of the moon illusion. However, we are still not sure of the exact answer. For one, we'd expect the moon illusion to disappear for pilots flying above the moon since there are no reference objects surrounding them. But even so, pilots and sailors still claim to experience the moon illusion. But now, I will tell you a secret. If you just bend over and look at the moon between your legs, the moon illusion will disappear entirely, like that. This is because upside down, trees and buildings don't register as familiar objects to act like references. As a result, your brain isn't tricked by the size comparison. One of the most promising explanations today for this phenomenon is known as the convergence micropsia theory. According to this theory, our brains calculate the distance between objects and their apparent size by the focus of our eyes, like the camera. This is why. When you are looking at the horizon, your eyes focus on something far off into the distance, so your brain knows that you are looking far away, so the moon appears a certain size. Consequently, you naturally conclude that the moon must be big. However, when looking up at the night sky, then there is nothing for your eyes to focus on, so they converge their wrist focus, which is a point few meters away. Enhance, your brain thinks that the moon is much closer than it really is, so you automatically conclude the moon isn't big as you thought. Still not satisfied? Well, you're not the only one. Debates about this phenomenon still rage on, so maybe one day we'll come up with the exact explanation for this mysterious illusion.